you guys need some cheap and reliable coins, man, check out my sponsor, AOEAH.com, for the cheapest coins on the market, man. Use code BREE for 3% off your order. Ladies and gentlemen, man, we will be ranking the best team of the year players to pick for you guys today. There's a lot on this list, so we're going to have to get through this pretty, pretty quickly. I will be live by the time you guys are seeing this video. Um, continue uh, to subscribe, like the video. We're on the road to 16,000 subscribers. I think I posted like seven videos today. I'm trying to do the rest tomorrow. But let's go ahead and get started. We'll be ranking the best team of the year players, and I guess, you know, which one I recommend you guys pick up. These are like 28 plus cards. There's a lot. Uh, I'm going to um, put. Uh, Fred Warner, I guess it's the it's the best free one to pick. I mean, Fred Warner um, is not on there. So, yeah. Jair Alexander, I think he's going to be A to S tier. I think he's not the fastest one. But solid card as well. I think, what, 90? He's 97 speed. Uh, I'll probably put him in S. There's so many great cards in this promo. So, we'll, we'll go over that. Josh Allen, automatically S. I think one of the best quarterbacks in the game besides uh, the other quarterback just came from. The All Madden promo, Josh Allen is definitely S tier, no doubt in my mind. I think you guys are probably picking him out of everybody. Um, and this Nick Bosa, I looked at his card ability wise, his LTD is better. Um, stats wise, probably a little bit better here and there, but it comes down to abilities. I would just go with, uh, uh, I will put him in B. I, I wouldn't pick him to be honest with you. AJ Brown, another probably another B tier. I don't see nothing too too crazy. I don't think this is a card you would probably set out and go out for. Um, Brian Burns C tier. I don't think he got no type of pass. I, I, it's something he gotten that was just horrible. If I remember correctly, what was Brian Burns stuff? Burns, what did he get for a discounted? Yeah, he got just El Toro. He didn't get no edge slate elite for cheap, no double or nothing for cheap. Yeah, I see why I put him in C tier. That's kind of why. Jamar Chase, definitely S tier. Um, one of the fastest receivers in the game. Stuff to pick up. Who is this? Is that just, I can't really see who the hell this is. That's Max Charles. That's who they do. I think same thing is with both. Uh, shit, I, I'll probably put him in C, to be honest. I think ability-wise, yes, his AKA card is better than that one. I wouldn't pick the card up, to be honest with you. Like, I'm going to save you some more coins going with the other one. Uh, that's my... Maybe cost the same. You got to power him up, but still, I think ability wise, go with Mad Max. I mean, yeah, go with Mad Max, not this version. I believe I, I can. I can barely see who half these guys are because the way this Austin Eckler. If you're passing to your receiver a lot, I mean, you're running back a lot, and if you throw like short end and stuff like that, definitely gonna be S tier. If you want not gonna throw it a lot, I think B tier. Um, I'll, I'll like I say he has an, another card out there, but. I would for sure go B tier, my personal opinion. She'll at least be 98. Um, no bruiser, no backfield, uh, no, no bruiser, no arm bar, nothing like that, even though he's not this style, but um, doesn't get no tank or nothing like that. So I don't know if he even gets goal line back. So I'll probably put him in B tier. Uh, Mika Fitzpatrick, definitely S tier, one of the best free safeties out there. Him and still Nolan. Well, not Nolan, not a free safety, but ah, I guess you'd probably say one of the best free safeties in the game. He, he moves really, really good. Sauce Gardner, definitely S tier, 98 base speed, 6'3". Um, I can say that's kind of an upgrade a little bit. I think ability stack is the same for me, but just better stats. I mean, it's cheaper for some of you guys to afford him, even though not the LTD is more affordable now. But, you know, I think if you had the choice, S tier for definitely Sauce. I believe this is Miles Garrett. I think he might be one of the best, probably one of the best pass rushers out there because he does have to get the edge for the elite and double nothing combo for one AP. So I definitely will put him in S tier. Cam Hayward, no, I, I don't think he gets no good pass rush abilities, but run stopper, like for stopping a run, and as far as pass rush, probably C and B because he doesn't really get that. So that's kind of a big thing for a lot of guys right now. Um, Tyreek Hill, 99 base speed, definitely got to put him in S tier. Um, Naeem Himes, as far as running back, I... What is, what was his what is what was his I, I don't remember for sure what is his name I'm sh uh I know he's return man so I kind of put him on here uh, so I gotta put him in the same tier as uh Eckler where is he at same basically the same tier as Eckler to be honest with you you throw to your running back a lot but for me I'm gonna get him because I want him for the return man for zero um probably be A or a S but I think for sure very similar to Austin Eckler. Um, I think this is Creed Humphrey. So this is what I'm going to do for you guys. Usually in any promo, this is the first time we have gotten like major champions in the game. Because usually we get like heroes, not champions for free. For this particular promo, I would not pick a lineman. Unless he fits your TNT, but I would not pick a lineman. All linemen will go in A for this particular point. Because I think it's so many great cards for you to pass up to pick a lineman. Do not pick a lineman in this promo. 
Do not. Marlon Humphreys, I think he's really, really good. Six foot, 98 base speed. Go with him. Uh, Jalen Hurts, I'm going to go eight tier. Don't like generic three. Gets all AFC. Was it? No, I think it's NFC. Gets all NFC chemistries. Um, solid AP set. I think he's gunslinger for zero. I just don't like the release. Truly, my personal opinion with Gen three, but for sure, definitely, I think it's an A tier. Um, Dermot James definitely S tier. One of the best users in the game. Him and uh, Tariq Woolen. Go pick him up if you need a safety. Uh, I believe this is. I can't really see. That's J Jettas. I think definitely no doubt in my mind. S tier. Um, I believe this is Jason. Yeah, Lane Johnson was the same thing. I'm going to put all linemen in A, so I wouldn't recommend picking that. Aaron Jones, I would probably go C tier. He's slower than the rest of the guys. I think he probably gets a solid AP setup, but just slow. I believe this is Chris Jones. I think we'll go A tier. I mean, I mean think about it. We're getting Tony Saragusa. He's another card. That's another uh, free John Madden. So you could go him. I'm, I'm going to put him in A tier for now, but that's his D lineman. I probably go with B, my personal opinion. Uh, I believe this is Juicy J. Don't not pick no fullback. We have Larry Zonka. Don't, don't waste no damn fullback. Um, Jason Kelsey, once again, will go in A tier, but I wouldn't recommend it. Travis Kelsey, same with A. We all have Gronk. He has a, a Super Bowl card. You can use a strat item, so... Yeah, probably relatively you know sooner. I wouldn't even matter of fact, I wouldn't even pick him. Pick him B. I believe next one is George Kittle. Ah. I want to say the same because once again, majority of us have Gronk, so I wouldn't waste it on another tight end. But if you don't have Gronk, definitely these guys will definitely be in both in A. But in my personal opinion, I'm putting it in B. I wouldn't do it. Uh, Zach Martin, same thing. Go with A. One lineman, wonderful, but don't waste it on that. Uh, McCaffrey, A. Well, actually, if you really think about it, I think McCaffrey is kind of the same way. Is still like, well, everyone loves Christian McCaffrey. <sighs> yeah, if you throw to your running back a lot, I would go A. Actually, I think hold on. Yeah, actually, no, I would put him A. I would put him A. Um, even though I want to put him in B so bad, but I like Christian McCaffrey cards. He's also running back a lot. Like I said, all three of them guys would be S tier, but since like no bruiser, if you're a traditional runner, he's not going to do much for you uh, for like those ability wise. Quentin Nelson definitely be A. Uh, Michael Parsons be S. I never seen his abilities yet, but I think because we all know how crazy Marco, Michael Parsons plays for you Cowboys team team. Ramsey. Me personally, I have him in A. He's S, but in my personal opinion, he's A. No deep route KO for no discounted price. That is a huge red flag for me. That is a huge red flag. You got to have deep route KO for me. He does get one step ahead for 4 AP, which is taxing, but it does help with short, medium, and deep, which can be great, but I still think you can get beat on them cuts regardless. But he does get that. But I'm going to put him in the S, but for sure, personal opinion, no deep route for me is a big red flag for me. Um, Hassan Reddick. Probably be A tier. I don't. I don't think he gets too too crazy uh, abilities for that. So Tan um, S tier, uh, a punter. I'm gonna go D. I'm assuming this is Justin Tucker. I'm gonna go S. 99 kick power at this point of the year until we get a Legends kicker. Oh hell yeah! But don't waste it on the damn punter. Bobby Wagner D. Trent Williams would definitely be A. So this will be my recommendation if you guys are looking for the best team of the year players. Now you say if I had to rank them in each tier, I think Allen would be one. Chase would be two. Derwin would be three. Sauce would be four. Mink, I don't put a bit about uh, right there. Mink of five. Uh, Jettis would be six, in my personal opinion. Probably Parsons would be next, maybe for you Cowboys fans. Uh, Tyreek would be next. Oh, uh, Ramsey. I, I no step one. No, no deep route is a big, big no no for me. Uh, Jair would probably be last, and Marlon. Yeah, that's what I would kind of rank it to be honest with you guys. Um, well, I'll put Sertan over him because at least he gets that. Yeah, that'd be my S. As far as A tier, like it's all strictly linemen, kind of would just stay the same. Um, B tier, uh. Yeah, I would kind of leave that as a B tier. C tier is fine. D tier is fine. Um, so let me know in the comments down below. Who would you guys pick for the your best free team of the year? I'm out. Peace.